Time for this week's National Hunt Flat Race then. This is of course a two miler from four year old novices, or four year old and upward novices. At the top we've got Clown, Graham Clutterbuck, Discovery Banker, Leon Van Rensburg, Losing the Will, Joshua Sutherland, Viking Art from you, and that's the only newcomer, which is a bit of a surprise. First date, David Hooley and Gravy Baby for Derek Hinton. Well, away they go. No hurdles, no fences. No stalls, but a two more flat race. And looking, losing the will, is looking to be the one who's going to take them along, I think. Point for its head wants to go a little bit quicker. And Viking Art has now taken it up. Still irks me somewhat that we've got the three top national trainers in this race, which is. Anyway, he's Viking Art in the lead. Surely an opportunity for a lower rank trainer to get a winner. We're going to have these, let's make them not to a hundreds or something. And right, it's Viking Art in the lead from losing the wheel second. Discovery Banker is third. And Claire and Gravy Baby are in first date. Viking Art's the leader. Oh, I'm losing the will. Maybe quite aptly named. First date back in third, then Discovery Banker, then Clown, and then Gravy Baby. There is a ghost. Viking Art is in the lead. I'm losing the will second. Discovery Banker, Clown. Maybe in first date, Munas looking for his first National Hunt winner. So what fast club his first National Hunt winner turned out to be a flat race. But there you go. Throw a few horses in to the jumps to see how it works. Currently leads by about a length to losing the will. He's now taking it up again. Discovery Banker now coming through, and we get ready for the Leon versus Josh battle. Uh, David Hooley might have something to say about that. With his first date, but it looks like losing the will. And Discovery Banker are the strongest two at the moment. They've still got five furlongs to go. Losing the will's in the lead from Discovery Banker second. And on the outside is Clown. And gravy baby and first date is next. Viking art is dropping away pretty quickly. And it's losing the will. And he's in the lead by two lengths. There's still three furlongs to go. And losing the will in the lead. Oh, and gravy baby is just about second now. Discovery Bank is not quickened up at all. First date has gone into third. Losing the will. Now being challenged by Gravy Baby. There's still a full on half to go. And Gravy Baby is now coming up alongside losing the will here. And Gravy Baby's taking it up. And Gravy Baby is in the lead. Could Gravy Baby be the first ghost horse to win in S07? And it's Gravy Baby who's causing a bit of a surprise here. And Gravy Baby takes it. Close for second, just losing the will. Then Clan. And a pretty impressive performance from the horse that died in the first week of the season to take that one. I think it's week two, I think. But anyway, Gravy Baby, it's never over. But it's over. And even then it isn't over. <laughs> Gravy Baby wins it for Terry Kinton. Losing the will, Joshua Sullivan. Second, first date, David Hooley. Third, Clown for Graham Crutzbock. Fourth, and Discovery Bank for Leon Van Rensburg is fifth. And now... For the first time this season, a return to the commentary box for your friend of mine, the housewives' favourite, Mr. Stu Gray.